Hello, my name is Julian Potter and I'm Head of Sales here at EFLEX in the UK. Whilst travel and shows are limited this year due to the current changing situations that we're in, we thought we'd put together a series of videos to talk about how the multiplexing side of EFLEX works, all of the devices and how it all comes together. So let's get stuck in. By distributing the power and circuit protection modules closer to the devices that they're switching, it helps simplify the wiring limbs within the vessel or the vehicle. The control and monitoring information is all sent via a two-wire network which enables complex switching routines and additional circuits to be added with ease. The EPLEX product line is comprised of intuitive user interfaces, power distribution modules, machine interfaces and sensors and software. These components electronically connect engines, generators, tank levels, lights, HVAC, AV and other systems together that result in a seamless monitoring and control solution for the vessel. On the power distribution side, Let's start with the DC 8050PM power distribution module. So this device has eight channels with outputs capable of up to 15 amps each, no more than 50 amps continuously for the module. Pairs of channels can be configured to operate in parallel. PWM dimming capability on all channels and each channel can be used as an input. It has reverse battery protection status LEDs for each channel, thermal, short circuit and programmable overload protection, local manual override capabilities and it's designed for motor and high in rush current loads. There are several ways in which you can control these outputs. For lighting control for example you can use a conventional switch wired directly into one of the inputs of the module or into one of our 827 OIM input modules. You can also use the 416 TPS touch panel light switch which allows for custom layouts with multiple touch buttons and interchangeable bezels to blend in the other devices on board. There are also feedback LEDs so you know if the light is on or if the circuit has tripped. Our 428 RSP digital rocker switch is one of the most flexible rocker switches available today. It's used to control any of our power distribution modules, either AC or DC, and is fully configurable from momentary to latching, and also has tricolour LEDs which can be programmed to indicate the status of the device or the status of the output. The 400 ECM touchscreen not only operates as a server for the system and its programming, but also has a basic touchscreen interface, which allows you to again do some more control, plus also some custom diagnostics and monitoring information of some of the other devices on the, on the network. The eLogic software that we use to program the system is powerful, flexible and intuitive to use. It allows for you to design very, very complex systems, but also very simple systems too. The 900 HMI is a full colour Windows based LED backlit colour display. It's 10 inch multipoint projected screen with customisable graphics and a magnetic mounting bracket so it can be removed without the use of tools. So if you're looking to monitor the battery status on your vehicle or your boat, you can use the EPLEX 331 BMI, capable of plus or minus 300 amps, engine cranking amps is capable, charging and load sensing to and from the battery, and voltage output sensing from the battery. For tank monitoring situations, you can use the 319 RSN. It can be used to sense pressure, temperature and fluid levels, reads values from 0 to 300 ohms, that has a table generator, for unequal shaped tanks, interfaces with standard resistive tank sensors from 0 to 180 ohms, 240 ohms to 30 ohms, and allows for a parallel interface to analog gauges. So thanks for taking a look at our EPLEX overview. If there is any more information you'd like about any of the devices that I've shown today or anything else that we may do, 
please don't hesitate to get in touch.